Hey, what's up guys? Today I have this really neat functionality for you. It's uh, basically slowing down time like in games where you can manipulate time. Uh, when you walk around, when you do whatever, when you start holding Q or the button of interest, time gets slowed down. But when you stop holding Q, it um, returns to normal. And uh, there, it's really simple to do this. You might not like the slowing down time effect that Unity has. Um, this is the most like basic thing you can do. You can probably make this a bit smoother, but that would have to that will require some other things. So um, I'll just show you the simplest way, and you can mess around with it to create a better effect if you want. So basically, have the script. It's gonna be available on GitHub, so you don't have to worry. Um, in the update function, we check if we get key if we hold down the Q button. So that's what this get key button or get key part does um, if it if I would have uh, to typed here get key down it's only gonna check if we click Q so um, it did only checks one frame if the button is clicked but this checks all the frames if it's being held down so if it's being held down the time dot time scale is 0 0.5 so you can change this value to um, get a better effect for example I'm gonna put 65 over here uh, else, if the Q button is not being held down, the time dot time scale is one. It's back to normal. We don't need this F here. Um, really simple, really basic way to slow down time. Um, I'll show you other videos of being able to manipulate time. For example, I might make a system as in super hot or something. We'll um, you know, check it out. Or um, for example, when you enter through a trigger the time gets slowed down so something cool happens thank you for watching the video i'll see you in another one bye